and we're back to learning Premiere Pro and this time I'm going to show you how to fake a tail shift effect. So we're going to use regular footage and apply a simple blur effect to fake this tail shift. Just type in blur. For example, we can use the fast blur. It should give us the best results, but you could also use different blurs, for example, Gaussian. Here it is now in effect controls. If you can't find these menus, go to window, click on effect controls and effects. They should pop up. At first, let's change the blurness. Let's make it 100 and you can see it, but the edges, then we've got a problem. So check this box for repeat edge pixels. The problem is solved. Now we want to use a mask to apply the blur only to selected areas. You could use an ellipse, a rectangle or the pen tool. I'll just use this rectangle and then I reposition the anchor points using the cursor tool. And you can see that everything inside of the mask has this blur, everything out of it doesn't. And we want to invert it so that the sensor isn't blurred. For now the edges are very sharp, so let's increase the feather. You can see this dash dotted line right here, it indicates the feather. And you can crank it up quite a lot. Let me just use 500. But the blurriness is a little bit too much. Let me go down, maybe to 50. And it's still too high, let me go down, maybe 35 or something. And I even increase the feather once more. Let me use 600. But that's basically it. You can see that it's not a perfect tilt shift. You would need a special lens for that. But you can create this fake effect and it creates somewhat of the illusion of a tilt effect using this blur in Premiere Pro. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.